Hey guys, I've just got a couple small little behind the scenes things that I've been doing around here. Also just wanted to give a little update on the uh, the comment glitch situation that I was talking to you guys about in the last video. And I think I'll start with that first actually. So it is not only other people's videos, but anytime YouTube notifies me about a comment and I go to try to uh, check it out, it, like anytime the comment disappears. So once again, just want to uh, reiterate, well, most of the time I'll see it in my notifications and I'll just go through it the long way. But if for some reason um, that I, I just never get back to, it's probably why, because YouTube is being stupid as per usual but anyways let us talk about what i've been doing so i haven't gotten any new fans i've sent a message about one but the morons haven't gone back to us yet and i don't necessarily have time for stupid honestly the fan isn't even i don't even know what the hell it is it's some weird tripod looking thing i don't even know if it's worth getting but it's free and it's not terribly far away so i figured it'd be cool looking and i could certainly resell it if everything was there if i hated it that much but anyways, so besides that, I've just done some small little reorganizing things about the about the basement. So um, first of all, um, a lot of these single fitters for ages have just been socketless. I finally went ahead and put a socket to pull chain on one and I got to go buy some more and then I'll continue working on the other three that I have to work with. And in going with that, I'm also going to try to get that uh, the classic concepts dynasty there back up and running. One of the socket wasn't working on it. And also a lot of other things just weren't necessarily working too good with it. So I need to double check with everything and see what on earth is going on in there. There's some weird wiring and all sorts of stuff. So I got to try to see what all that goes to and work out whether it's safe or what on earth I am. Uh, what on earth I need to do there. But once I worked it out, um, I might do a remake of it. Anyways, so that was just something random I'd been doing. I also did a, do a bit of reorganizing. I needed another blade stack. So I just went ahead and made one. Then I put all the small blades back on. For a while, they were just in a box on the side, but I moved them over to here instead. And then, obviously, when this area got smaller, most of that stuff is still there, but I put that little uh, set of parts down there. And most of this other stuff is the same. I don't have a box for the for the uh, Springfield arms, so they're just sitting there for now. Anyways, yeah, everything else here is the same. The other thing I've done is I essentially just made this into a proper pile now, or like another proper... Uh, I guess also, I guess pile's an okay word. I also floor tested these two Menards fans, and they both work fine. So I'm going to try to get some blades for them, spray paint them, and complete them. Also, I'm going to get down rods and brackets for them, but I'll worry about that later. Everything else sort of just got piled in a little bit better over here. I still have to take the down rod probably off that fan and that Fasco, but I don't know when that'll happen. The light kit has to come off the Fasco, too. That thing's just been sitting there for months. And uh, one of the other things I did was... I went in and I replaced the socket in this uh, this Verde light kit that came with that uh, that quorum there. And it was actually a little bit more interesting than I thought. It wasn't difficult. However, it turns out that uh, they probably, like, overloaded that socket because it literally blew. Like, the wires were frayed. And so typically how it works is... Um, inside this bowl actually hang on you know what i can just uh i can just show you really quick because this is essentially one of the last interesting things i um i have to talk about so i'll just go ahead and take the finny off and i'll just go ahead and um and uh show you so here we go all right i'm gonna set you guys down for a minute here so i can get the uh the glass shade off of the safely there we go okay so now I'll go ahead and move back over here. So here's how it works. So essentially, you've got the wires that are all hooking up and connecting inside of here. And here's where they essentially come through. So they, these can screw off. And so they can screw off now like they won't come separate because obviously the wires are holding it on. But when I unscrewed the one that was uh, that was frayed, it literally just came right off. And there was a black burnt wire. Let me see if I can find which socket it was because... One of them, um, one of them had a, oh, it was this one over here. So you could just see all that black there, like it's literally sooty and stuff. And if I touch it, my hands will get dirty again. But as you can see, I did a go in and replace the socket. But yeah, it was a, it was a disaster. I don't know what the hell they did. And these two aren't necessarily looking the greatest either, but they're still okay. So I've got some uh, new LED candelabra bulbs I'll probably throw in there next time. I already tested it and it works just fine. So yeah, that was a, that was a little bit of an interesting thing I found out about that. Anyways, yeah, this fan is still up, by the way. I've been actually been using it as a utility fan quite a bit. It works great. I love that fan still. Then over here, I, I had to move that spotlight kit because when I took the Dynasty down for a sec, 
I had to rearrange the shelf over there and there wasn't a place for it. So just moved it over here. Otherwise, everything is mostly the same. <clears throat> Besides, I just bought a couple other sets of light bulbs I need, but that's not really interesting. And um, the only other things I'm going to mention here before I leave you guys is that um, I ordered everything I need for the wrap. Um, now, like a fish, I might have mentioned it before, but before they did not have the uh, they did not have the model number for the control and the receiver. They now do, and they have now gone ahead and um, placed that order. And I don't know when it'll come in, but at some point it will. And also, they have told me I can go look around, try to find some parts for my Apollo, because they might, they've might they got a lot of parts lying around at that showroom. There's also another showroom which I'm going to go work at for a day. Basically, they've got a bunch of old stuff, including catalogs, um, cool dealer memorabilia and stuff that they kind of want gone. So I'm going to go sort through it, see what I can take home. There might even be a fan or two involved. Can't guarantee anything, though. But yeah, so I'm going to go and work there for a day and hopefully bring something of sort of interest home. That would um, that would be kind of, uh, kind of nice, that's for sure. But whether it'll happen, I cannot say for sure. But anyways, yeah, so that's what I've, uh, that's what I've got going on, and at this point, I'm out of shorts, and now I've got, so at this point, all I have left to upload that aren't, like, the standard, uh, demos and stuff, and the typical, uh, scheduled videos, I've got my collaboration videos with Dan when we met up back in, uh, August, and then I've also got just a whole bunch of Menards, Lowe's, and Home Depot videos that I've recorded over the, like, the last year that I have to upload, then once that happens, I'll be literally all out of bonus content, from that point on, I'll finally be able to start only uploading videos of these um, these fans here. I'm not necessarily going to change my schedule until I run out of catalogs or portables. But anyways, yeah, um, that's. I just want to mention that quick so you guys sort of had an idea on what's going to go on in the future. But anyways, I'm going to go ahead and end this video because I don't want it to be too long. So it takes, like, I don't want it to take forever to upload. So with that, I will see you guys later. Goodbye.